back to my channel today's video is in collaboration with Julie she this video is specifically for if you're going on vacation or something and you don't really want to focus too much on your hair you just want it to be cute and ready to go this is like the best method to do making sure that you prep your wig before you go anywhere on vacation even if you're home going to work any of that if you're brand new to wigs this is the perfect video for you so I'm gonna show you guys completely glueless and it's nice and prepped it's nice and flat at the top everything perfectly fine this is how thick the hair is all the links and specs to this wig will be down below if you're interested this is how the curls look and all i used was some water miel conditioner leave-in conditioner and my demon my demon brush and i just put it to dry like literally like this so the curls could do this ringlet type things so yeah, I will have all the links down below. This is their packaging, it's the same packaging like all the other ones that I had before. 
It came with the wig cap. It also came with this sticky thing that you put on the lace to help it look more like skin. I did not use that today. I just put it on like regular, but you can use that as well. It came with a head wrap and the standard packaging. So I came up with this idea, but I don't know if it's gonna work. So, the kids are talking outside. Okay, so I don't know if I cut off my lace can I use my edges for my closure instead of doing closure edges? Hmm. I'm gonna see. All I'm gonna do is put my foundation inside the lace, cut the lace off. If you did not check out a video like that before, I will link one up here or up here, somewhere. So you guys can check it out, okay? Check out, I have a lot of videos showing you guys how to install wigs. I just wanna test a little something out to see if it's gonna work and if it's gonna look natural. Okay, so, Obviously, hopefully you guys know that every time you take your closure wig off, you have to do the edges over when you put your wig on. So I was thinking, maybe if I just did my natural edges, I could just pop my closure on top. So obviously, I'm going to have to take a little bit out to make it really blend in. So let me see, hopefully I can work this. Hopefully this comes out good. So as you can see, I already had did my, my natural baby hair, so. This wig is pretty. Okay, so I'm gonna take out some of the hair and see how that's gonna look. Ah, uh, that's doing too much. No, it's looking a mess. Okay. I'm just gonna install it my regular way. All right, you guys, this is the end of the video. I hope you enjoyed it. And if you did, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Comment a palm tree down below or some white hearts, whichever you prefer if you got to this part of the video. I know that you got to this part when you comment those things. Thank you guys so much for checking me out. I hope this video was helpful. And let me know if you feel like this is gonna help you on your wig game. Like, it's gonna make it more easier for you to install your wig and that it's nice and prepped so you don't have to have a long process with doing your wig at all i hope this video helped somebody out there and if it did don't forget to thumbs up and comment down below letting me know that you learned something don't forget to visit julie she i will have the links down below so you guys can check them out and for one last time i'm going to turn around so you guys can see the hair this is probably one of the fullest wigs that i have received keep in mind i haven't had it for that long so i can't really tell you the longevity of it or nothing like that it's not giving me too much shedding at all right now so that's good for me this is how the edges look this is a five by five closure so it stops right here and this is how the lace is looking i did go ahead and put some um, old mascara in the roots since I over bleached the knots and I also fixed the part with my concealer All right, so Don't forget to visit Julie she I will have the links down below I hope you guys enjoyed this video and let me know if you feel like prepping your wigs would make your install much better than you trying to do it You know like rushy or whatever doing it on your head I did prep it on my mannequin head You could also use like the styrofoam head that will that's perfectly fine. That's a mannequin head as well so yeah, thank you guys so much for checking me out and I will definitely see you in my next one. Bye!